Good morning guys, it is Wednesday and it is opposite day. So today we are dressing up as students and the students are dressing up as teachers. So I'm gonna show you what I'm wearing. So I'm wearing pigtails and yes, I did get my hair dyed. Like I said, my hair is totally different now. Um, it is way blonder. And I used to wear my hair like this a lot in high school and in college, so I'm used to it. But I did get some kitty cat ears. You can kind of see them with the background, but they're like gold with pearls. And then I am wearing my best year ever t-shirt from Lipstick and Littles. It just looks like that. And if you guys haven't already checked out Lipstick and Littles on Instagram, she has the most amazing t-shirts. They have the best quality and they have like the cutest sayings on them. And I have like every single one. I think like I'm missing like three out of all of them. <laughs> but I'm a little obsessed. And then I have on some overalls, and these are just some overalls that I found at my local boutique last week. <clears throat> and then I have on my pink high top Converse, and I did get myself a squishy because all of my kids have squishies. So I got a little fat unicorn, or they call it thick unicorn. So that's gonna be my squishy. I'm gonna carry it around with me all day. Today is also game day. So while I was at Walmart, I just grabbed myself a snack because I love popcorn and I didn't pack a lunch. So I have a snack. And then I picked up the game Uno because everybody loves Uno. And I put this on my classroom account. So anytime I make any extra money, I put it into a different account. Um, my princess parties, I put this into this account. Anything I make extra, I just put into an account for my classroom. So I used that money to get some Uno and I found this really cute game called Pictopia, and it's made by Disney. And I guess it's like something to do with like pictures and stuff, I'm not sure. It looks like you do competitive stuff with like guessing answer questions, revealing things. It has to do with like Disney and like child related things, so I thought that would be cute. And I figured it would be great for third grade too since, you know, they're a little bit younger. But I have like a gaggle of Disney fans in here, so I figured maybe we would play that together today. So yes, today is game day. First thing we're gonna do this morning is we are going to move all of the desks and push them that direction and stack them for the summer. Then we're gonna stack the chairs and then kind of clean up in here so that it's more of like a game space. <clears throat> also, the kids did work on their geometrosities. Uh, this week and this is the end result which looks pretty cool these two are obviously mine because they're not like obnoxiously colored but I think they did a great job the, the kids that did finish um, I think they did a great job like this one has a fries food store a taxi a hotel this one's got a fire truck and a burning building I mean they got really creative the ones that did finish, so uh, we'll keep those somewhere safe, but they're gonna teach me their lessons after we've moved everything. We have our spirit and pride assembly, which is where we talk about like student of the quarter, um, honor roll, things like that. And then the rest of the day is game day. And I did allow my kids to bring electronics today, but they also had to bring a game board, a board, a game board. They also had to bring a board game. So if they were going to bring an electronic, they also had to bring a board game so that the rest of us could play because not everyone's going to bring an electronic. So I also grabbed a giant jug of water because I am sick and I'm going to take my day quill right now because I also bought that. I didn't get the real stuff. I just got the knockoff brand because it's just the same. But I'm going to go sneak over to Jennifer's room and see what she's wearing because I'm very interested to see and maybe we'll take a couple pictures and yeah. So happy Wednesday. You. Um, Let me see your outfit. Hello, third grader. Ooh, I like a backpack girl. That's my friends. <laughs> <laughs> this one's looking cute too. <laughs> Look at her hair. That, your hair thing. I want to see. Oh my god. That's great. And they're kitty cat ears. So you're Alice in Wonderland themed, right? Yes. I have a Cheshire Cat costume. Oh my god. Because <laughs> I was the Cheshire Cat in the, um, what you call it? I Musical. I'm gonna go to duty I with you. Duty! <laughs> duty!
Hi everyone, it is Thursday, May 24th, and today is the last day of school. It is extremely bittersweet. I do not know how to explain how I'm feeling right now. I'm excited, I'm sad, I'm sick, and I'm just really, really looking forward to moving to my new home, moving to my new school, but I'm also really sad because I'm leaving a wonderful place where I thought I was gonna call home, and I'm leaving a lot of wonderful coworkers, I'm leaving a lot of wonderful students, and it is very sad to me. Um, but it is time to move on. I probably will cry today. Uh, I'm not wearing any makeup for a couple of reasons. I am gonna participate in field day and there's gonna be water things, so I'm not gonna wear makeup because I know I'm gonna get ruined. I'm also planning on crying a lot and I'm sick. So wearing makeup just didn't make any sense today. I went to Starbucks and got my vanilla iced coffee with cream and I got my egg bites. And this morning I'm folding <coughs> report cards. I also need to print out class awards. So like, you know, superlatives. And I need to write my notes on the pictures that I picked up for my kids yesterday. So I took selfies with all of my students and I'm planning on writing each of them a little note on the back of the picture. And there were a few students absent, so I do have um, just a selfie that I took wearing my school shirt last year. And this is funny because there's this little person working out in the background and she's got like a little workout outfit on. I have no idea what I was watching, but whatever. It looks like a little Barbie doll in the back. So like for example, where's Aiden's? I'll show you guys Aiden's picture. So I just took a picture of each of them like this and I'm gonna write them a little note because I still have a picture of myself and my fourth grade teacher and I have kept that forever because she was my favorite. We have a staff meeting, which I think is when we're gonna discuss all of the things that we're gonna be doing next week. Um, <clears throat> as I said before, we still have another week that we need to return. Hey guys, so the kids are at lunch. I'm gonna pick them up in 10 minutes and then we are gonna do our class awards, hand out report cards, and say our goodbyes. I'm probably not going to catch this on tape because it would just be, it wouldn't be as sentimental if I were to be like, hold on, let me set up the camera. So I'm just gonna leave you guys with this. Uh, it's gonna be a rough moment for me because I'm gonna miss all of these kids. But it's also positive and we all know why. Once the kids leave, I do have a meeting and then I'm gonna go to the doctor and get like a Z-Pack or something to knock this, whatever it is, out. And that way I can not get my baby sick. So, also my room is like trashed. <laughs> but luckily I have another week to come in here and kind of clean up and finish packing, which I really don't have a lot, so it shouldn't be an issue. But I'm gonna probably end this vlog here, maybe. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Hey guys, so I never ended yesterday um, the vlog, but today is Friday and we had lots of meetings and the last day of school went great. I had lots of criers and it was a blast, but I just got home from today's PD and meetings and I have a package here from We Are Teachers on Instagram and it's a huge box 
I don't know what's in it, so I'm going to open it right now on camera. Okay, so when I opened it up, this is what I'm seeing. There's a little note here. And it says, hey Charlotte, we are thrilled to share this amazing box of goodies with you. Our friends at Moving Minds really pulled out all the stops to package up some incredible items to keep your kids' mind and bodies active. We'd be thrilled to know when you get your package, so if you get a chance to post or share a story on Instagram about these goodies, please be sure to tag at Moving Minds and We Are Teachers. Thank you and enjoy. Love your friends at We Are Teachers and Moving Minds. Ooh, P.S. Use code ACTIVE20 for 20% off your next order at movingminds.com. Share with your friends. Expires July 31st, 2018. Ooh. A gift card to Gopher. Ooh, that's physical education stuff. Don't make me use my teacher voice. I think these are stickers. That is so cute. Did you see a $100 gift card? Teach like a boss slash teacher. I believed I could change the world, so I became... These are so cute. These are um, stickers. Uh, for the, like, to get kids? No, for me. Nice. And then this looks like it's a... What is this? Tilt Ed go for... Oh, it's a seat, I think. I think that's a type of, like, wobbly chair. I could be wrong. I could be totally wrong. I got these cute little um, dice for like exercises. And then this one says how many to do. That is so cool. Oh, they're gonna fall. Ooh, I got a boggle game. This is a fun game. I got a Brain Breaks book. I actually have a bunch of Brain Breaks from a book that I bought in college, but this is way faster. So cool. Ooh, awesome. I love doing these in class. Yeah. Also got a bag that says teachers change the world one student at a time. This is so cute. Little bag. Sorry, my sniffles. And this looks like a, ooh, an icebreaker ball. You know, I made one of these my first year teaching and I totally got destroyed and I had like the most boring things on it. But this is awesome, I'm so using this at the beginning of the year next year. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. So again, this is from moving-minds.com and if you use that code ACTIVE20, you get 20% off. How cool, okay, I'm gonna take a picture of this and post it on the Instagram. Okay guys, so this is going to be me officially ending this vlog and the next couple of vlogs that you will see will all be like personal, probably not teaching related, but I like vlogging in the summer about my life as a teacher in the summer and you'll see lots of cash I'm sure and lots of Mr. Valdez. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys!